probably for our viewers out there who don't know what you're talking about it unexplained wealth, uh, although straightforward, what is that looking like? I'm just thinking uh, a fisherman who all of a sudden hits $150,000 in his account with one transaction. But what is unexplained wealth for our people? Well, it, it, uh, as the director just said, that there are, there are certain triggers on the unexplained wealth side. Mm -hmm. So that there has to be an investigation by a law enforcement body first. So whether that's the tax department, the integrity mm -hmm. commission, police, or the FIU themselves, they, after that investigation, if they feel that the person they've looked at has wealth that cannot be explained, they can refer it then to the civil recovery agency to then do an investigation. Mm -hmm. But you have to remember is that it, the biggest safeguard, and I'm trying to uh, allay fears of the public, they still have to prove that either the property or the unexplained wealth has come from crime. They can't just say, oh, we suspect, we suspect ah. you've got too much money and I can't see where it's come from. That's not enough. They've still got to link it to some sort of unlawful activity. Active. So what it's there to do is basically to highlight that crime doesn't pay and it shouldn't be seen to pay. Mm -hmm. So everyone will know someone who appears to be living a lavish lifestyle without having any legitimate income. Um, <clears throat> and the act is, is there, to, as, as Lenny just said, to target those cases which you can't get through the criminal sphere. But unexplained wealth is, is very much the new uh, tactic that's being used uh, to target, particularly corruption. That's what it's, it's there to look at, essentially.